Hi everyone, this is Emmanuel, and in this video I'm going to show you how to fix the SSL certificate for Elementor. So, if you're using Elementor, when you install your SSL, you might get this error, where your website says HTTPS, but it still shows up as not secure. So, how do you fix that? I'm going to show you, it's really simple. The first thing you want to do is go back into your dashboard, go to your plugins, and we're going to add a new plugin. So just search up SSL. And you should see a plugin called Really Simple SSL. If you don't see it, just search it exactly as Really Simple SSL and click Install Now. Then click Activate. And then click Go ahead and activate your SSL. If you don't see this right away, you can also find it by going to the plugin and going to settings. But you can click it from right here. And then you see this says SSL activated. So let's see if it worked. As you can see, it hasn't worked yet. That's because there's an extra setting that we need to do for Elementor. Let me show you. We're going to go back into the dashboard. We're going to need to log in again. Okay, we're going to go into Elementor, and we're going to go into Tools. Then we're going to go to Replace URLs. Pretty much what we need to do is replace all of our old HTTP URLs into HTTPS URLs for all the files on our website. So we're going to copy our website name all the way down to the HTTPS. We're going to paste it into the new URL and we're going to paste it into the old URL. But on the old URL, we're going to go back and we're going to delete the S. So we're going to replace all the HTTP URLs to HTTPS. And we're going to click Replace URLs. Here shows that 42 rows of code were affected. So 42 items had the wrong URL and have been updated. Click OK. Click Save Changes. Once that's done, we go to general and we're going to regenerate some files just to make sure everything is working perfectly. So we're going to regenerate the CSS and sync the library. Then click save changes. Now when we go back to our website, we can see that the HTTPS is working and it should be working on all of our other pages as well. Hope this video helped you. If you have any issue setting up your SSL, please leave me a comment and I will try to help you out. Thank you so much. Have a great day.